Lille coach Paolo Fonseca was dealing with a defensive injury crisis of sorts ahead of his team's trip to Lorient Sunday. And it was a nightmare start for Lidog as Laurent Abergel picked Ignacio Miramont's pocket close to goal and confidently finished past Lucas Chevalier. The captain leading from the front and making the most of a lapse in concentration in the Lille defence. And the host struck again straight from kickoff as Serena Decore drove through a beleaguered Lille backline. Played it back to Julien Ponceau who fired it past Chevalier. Decore making an impact on his first start in the campaign after his goal last week. And both defensive midfielders getting on the score sheet for Lorient early on. And the miscommunication would continue for the Lille defence, as another wayward Chevalier ball was picked up by Fevre. This time though, the shot stopper is able to get across in time to smother the effort. A dream start for Régis Lebris' men, even if Lille was still threatening. Miramon looking to make amends with an attempt from range, but it's no issue for Mvogo. Something of a head scratcher for Paolo Fonseca. Lidog coming out after the break for more of an incisive edge. Yusuf Yuzici coming close with a free kick effort that goes over. Lidog coming out another chance minutes later though as Remy Kabila hands it over to Angel Gomez. Jonathan David played through and the Canadian dispatches it past some Voga in clinical fashion. The striker scoring his second goal of the campaign and pulling one back for the visitors. His 60th goal in all competitions for the Northerners. But the comeback was short-lived, as Laurent Abergel found Romain Febvre with a drifting ball over the top. The attacking midfielder only needing a single deft touch to lob the goalkeeper. The former Lyon man scoring his first goal for Le Merleau since making his move back to Brittany over the summer. A delightful outside of the foot finish to restore the two-goal lead for the hosts. And the danger would come from the left wing again just minutes later. The Lille defence carved open. And it's another through ball finding Théo Lebris. His shot parried into Vincent Legoff's path and the fullback tucks it away from a tight angle. Something of a crowd pleaser as the Breton's longest serving player finds the back of the net for the first time in over two years. Jonathan David with some good work in the box again for Lille, carving out a chance as the ball falls to Goodmanson, whose shot is parried away by Mvogo. And the Swiss goalkeeper once again called into action as Remy Cabela sends a long-range effort towards the bottom right corner. Lille sending waves of attacks forward as they look to get back into the game, but Lorient's defence holds steady and it's a statement result from the home team. The surprise package from last autumn looking like they can repeat the feat this year. Lorient still unbeaten and clinching their first win of the campaign against one of the favourites for the European spots. Paolo Fonseca's men though clacking a clinical edge, but hoping to be back on their feet soon enough as they prepare to take to the continental stage again in midweek.